Andrew, uh, who might be able to talk about the current conditions on why we're smelling this. Well, Sean and Priya, we were chatting about this before the newscast started, and one of the factors may be uh, the wind and the fact that the wind is very light or in some cases calm, no wind out there. So whatever the odor is or whatever the source of the odor is, Whatever the gas that is actually in the atmosphere, besides the normal uh, gases that we have, nitrogen, oxygen, with normal atmosphere, whatever man-made gas might be in the atmosphere, is taking a lower time, a less time to, to uh, propagate and move out of the area. We have a wind only of seven miles per hour over in Romulus. Elsewhere, it's also pretty light. You factor that in with high humidity. You also have a little bit of fog out there. Visibility is still pretty manageable at around three miles, but winds will continue to be light to calm as we go over these next couple of hours as DTE officials and environmental officials continue to do their work and continue to perform their measurements across the metro area. Temperatures right now mostly in the middle 30s, still above freezing, as we talked about last night at 11 o'clock. Temperatures hovering right around the same marks they were last night, mainly around 40 degrees farther north, but generally in the low and middle 30s elsewhere. It feels like it's around freezing or a bit more. Later on today, we'll see temperatures rise into the 40s, so thawing continues. There may be a little drizzle here and there as well. Sunrise this morning is at 745. Visibility is still pretty manageable across much of the area. Visibility at two and a half miles or greater, but count on that possibly going down as we still have these light winds and high humidity. Some fog may still form as we go through these breakfast hours up until about 8, 9, 10 o'clock this morning. Temperatures in your community, mostly in the middle and upper 30s, still around 40 degrees to our north and to our west. 42 right now over in Howell, while it's 35 over at Metro Airport. Again, we're still looking at pretty good visibility as we look at downtown Detroit. Temperatures get even higher later on this week. We'll talk about that. Continue monitoring the winds. Remember, you can do the same thing. Download the local forecasters app. It'll give you local weather in your neighborhood, including temperature, wind speed and wind direction, road conditions also. Local forecasters app with updated features is free in your app store. Search WDIV.